So many patients come into us and they talk about how their posture sucks or they're almost afraid to get their posture evaluated. Yet whatever it is noticeably different, whether in a child or adult, they'll go do structural things. We've got to understand the neurology behind poor posture, right? The head dictates where everything else goes. So if you have a misalignment, what we call a subluxation, the body has to compensate to keep that upright. So even with this poster here, the head shifts off, the brain wants to stay balanced, but then everything else, the shoulders can get contracted, a hip can be raised. You can even experience tight hamstrings, tight calves, all because of a misalignment here at the top. Posture is not just structural, it's neurological. If we can get the head and neck relationship exactly in alignment where they're supposed to be, we'll see improvement with that posture. For example, look at this gentleman here. This was his initial evaluation. He thought that that was normal with his head forward. As we focused on working on his neck, we started to bring the head more upright and we saw a huge change in his posture. Posture. Not because we fix something structurally, but because we change the information to his brain neurologically. Please follow us for more tips on information, how you can improve your brain health by affecting your posture.